is going on mates welcome to the channel we just arrived here at Mutura camp in Old Pejeta and they gave us hats David has always wanted me to get a safari hat um, yeah so now I have a safari hat I love it <laughs> okay. I think I think we're both rocking it definitely let's go see the test <laughs> So this is actually our front porch of our tent. We're on the savanna side. There's two different sides. Stay tuned for that tomorrow. <laughs> Outside of our tent, we have a little deck with a coffee viewing area. And my favorite, I have an outdoor bathtub, guys. I'm pretty excited to use that, not gonna lie. Okay, let's come and see inside. So, welcome to our tent. This is actually one of the two family tents that they have, or family setups. Um, where we did the intro on the bridge, if you go across that, there's another tent. And it can be set up for, I think it's like a triple even. So more single beds, kind of that one's for where the kids can stay. So anyways, king size bed, and I'm not gonna lie, it already looks so like comfortable and soft. I'm struggling for words right now. <laughs> anyways, it looks very inviting. And then you come over here to our little lounge area. It's basically a small living room, like, let's, let's face it, it's more than a lounge area. Then over here we have our water, our tea setup. You have a safe, always good to have a safe. And we actually have a fridge here. Now, oh, it's stocked. <laughs> it's a full mini bar. Uh, I love when camps have fridges because we tend to bring energy drinks and things so then they're able to keep cold. This is actually the main entrance. You'll see us walk out that area quite often. Over here, a little desk. And welcome to the bathroom. This is a huge Sorry, bathroom. I love these hats. Did I say that I love these hats? I just had to leave it I on. think we're rocking them. I'm rocking you it. You look great. Okay. I'm totally rocking it. Carry on. <laughs> bathroom, wardrobe area, robes. You always get me with robes. Um, a toilet, so. That's separate. It's, it's pretty nice to have when it's separate. And we have a shower and like a nice shower. So this is like a wooden kind of external and I'll point it out because David absolutely loves it is the flooring. He loves when camps actually have like a true floor. Um, so that was his first thing that he noticed when he came in. Mine is the fact that there's a bathtub outside. That's all. Look how nice this floor is. So this is the first time that I actually a real door for the bathroom in a tent and unless you have already lived with a loved one in a safari camp, you know how precious this door is. So as Tracy said, this is one of the family tents. So there's this tent here, a little bridge, and then just behind me, that's the other tent. Same exact thing as ours, except there's two beds. So perfect for the kids if they're not too young. It is now a lunchtime, and you guys know me, if the food is good, nothing else matter, even though this tent is so great that, you know, even if the food is like, mm, I wouldn't care that much. Anyway, the general manager already told me that like he told his chef that uh, Tracy and I are pretty foodie so I think they're ready for us. So we just ordered. Food looks very good and this place is actually overlooking a water hole and right now there's a bunch of zebras already. It was a very good lunch, I have to say. Everything was very delicious. Oh, that chocolate, they call it a chocolate cake, but it's more like chocolate <laughs> Tracy looks brownie. at a menu and she always makes the best <laughs> decision health-wise. <laughs> <laughs> now we're gonna try to go figure out what are our plans for the next two days. Who knows? We'll see. But first, let's check out the pool. This is probably like the nicest pool I've seen in a camp so far, but ah oh yeah, it's really cold. It's really, really cold. <laughs> So we've been working, I was gonna say chilling, but more like working in the room for the past hour or so. Tracy had to finish her vlog, which is gonna go live tomorrow. She, her vlogs always go live 
at 7 p.m. on Sunday, Sunday. So 24 hours after the one on my channel. So right now we are pushing the Wi-Fi at the camp to the max. This is the real test. If by tomorrow morning, if like basically within the next like 16 hours, this vlog is like up and running on YouTube, I'm gonna be like really impressed because normally like Wi-Fi in the oh, bush is not that great. We're at 1%, okay, okay yeah, 99% to go. That's about two minutes. So for I'll let you know if this uploads tomorrow because if it does, the Wi-Fi here is a 10 out of 10. So we are 50 minutes away from our safari drive and when you think about it this is going to be our first real actual safari drive with a safari truck with a safari guide within old pajeta because every time that we came here before we were either driving on our own or we were with the cheetah project and we're actually going to see them on monday so yeah. maybe tomorrow morning we'll look for some cheetahs ourselves if we see cheetahs we'll let them know for sure we'll see <laughs> Let's be lucky. We've never, we've seen cheetah like literally across Kenya, never in Opajeta. No. So no. fingers crossed. So today's video is brought to you by Fresh Hoods. They actually sent us a bunch of different pieces of clothes, like this beautiful like this one? crop top shirt that Tracy is modeling right now. And also... <laughs> <laughs> Simple colors, plain colors. With minimal branding, like this little rubber thing. I really like it, really like it. Stylish. It's great. <laughs> More colorful. And like patterns, really like it. Beautiful, beautiful. Are we good models? We're great models. <laughs> they even have bummer jackets. Pretty nice, very warm, perfect for safaris, especially in the morning. They have something for everyone, a huge variety from like patterns to plain colors as you've seen. You to can find shirt, something. bummer jacket, hoodies, shorts, Get me name out of it, the comfort they zone. have. Yeah. <laughs> so anyways, if you want to go check them out, link down below. There's no harm in checking them out. Just check it out. Have a Just look. Just check it out. Have, have a look. look. Maybe you'd like something. <laughs> Guys, if we can't find cheetahs in Old Pajeta with these cool hats, well, that means there's none. <laughs> I think we have some pretty cool hats. Yeah, I think we're we're rocking them. Yeah. I'll pretty happy them about those. Me too. <laughs> Hang on to your hat. It's safari time. This is one of the females from the Purini Pride, and I guess there's six of them. So three big females, two cubs, and one male. Maybe we'll get lucky and see the other ones. Was she right? Very right. Perfect. Yeah. <laughs> like that was a really good catch because I would have never seen that. Looks like a rock at the distance. Yeah. yeah. So we just arrived at our sundowner spot. It's a little cover, but it's still like kind of an orange sky at a distance, so it's still pretty nice. And we're surrounded by zebras and, and water bucks, a bunch of birds and some gazelles. So I like it. So for our sundowner, we have our drinks and we have some corn, bananas some bread, and I'm not sure what this one is, but it looks really good. Are those sugar canes? You, you, okay, but like, I want you to show me because I don't know how to eat that. Okay. Like, do I swallow it? Okay. No. No. <laughs> so I just like, Did I you just- Did you swallow any? It's okay. No, no, I didn't. Oh. I didn't. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm asking before I do it. Okay. So I just like, you just like suck the juice out of it. Kind of thing. Exactly. And you exactly. spit the rest. Exactly. Perfect. Just chew. The okay. Good. Just like that. Yeah. This is very good. <laughs> A little hard, but oh, the flavor's really good. Yeah. As we were enjoying our drink, there's a tall giraffe that just started to run, and just behind her, tiny baby giraffe. That was adorable. I thought I had everything, all the things life could bring. 
something. Might have a little surprise coming. He found something this afternoon and it might still be there. I don't know what it is. Pretty excited. He was lucky enough to escape. I mean to run away from that single lion yeah. because there was a uh, tons of clans of hyenas around trying to disturb them. So that zebra was actually attacked by a lion this afternoon. He actually managed to escape but died later on because of injuries and we just spotted a few hyenas that are heading there because the meal is waiting. See you in the morning. And just like that, we are back home in our tent. Not really home, but it's kind of homey like here. Home. I don't know if they do this for everyone because there was instant coffee there. I'm sure you could upon request, but they just brought me a coffee maker for the morning and like actual ground coffee, not just like instant coffee. Bonus points. <laughs> so like Dave said, we just got back and actually they're just finishing to set up our room for nighttime. Um, instead of hot water bottles, actually, I think I still see them in there as well. They actually have a blanket warmer. So you can warm up the bed beforehand. That's a pretty good touch. <laughs> Guys, you have no idea. This shower is better than our shower at home. Instant hot water and the best water pressure I've ever experienced. I can't relate how great the shower is <laughs> to the camera. I have to say the shower did live to Tracy's hype. It was, it was pretty good. Instant hot water and pressure. This is the best safari shower I've ever had, by far. And the fact that they have heaters in here and you don't get yeah. out freezing, like yeah. I'm... This is a blonde. good camp, guys. Yeah. It's a very good camp. Now we're gonna go have supper because, because it's supper time. <laughs> We have some chocolate coconut balls and banana. I want to say strudel, but it's strudel without the R. So strudel? Strudel. 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 <laughs> So we just came back from supper, which was very good. Oh, that steak was amazing. And the soup was good. Yeah. And those little coconut balls. Yeah. Big fan of those. Very good. So another great meal. Now we're going to go to bed or try to. It, it is so windy, guys, right now. It is very like, windy. I don't know if you can hear it, probably, but the tent is making a lot of noises. <laughs> anyway, so going to bed because tomorrow, a uh, very early breakfast and then an early game drive. We're going to go check if something is eating that zebra. Yeah, and if it's still there. Yeah, he seems to think it's still gonna be there. Probably. Just eating. We saw some hyenas going there yeah. too, uh, for a little midnight snack. And then in the afternoon, we're actually doing something that we never really did before. No. So stay posted for that, cause that's gonna be pretty cool. Yeah. See you day. in the morning. Good night. Good morning. Good morning. It's time to wake up. No. <laughs> yeah, we gotta go on the safari. No. <laughs> Let's go. So this morning we're actually doing things backwards to normally when we go on a safari. We actually have our very early breakfast and then go on safaris. And you know what? I'm very hungry when I first wake up in the morning, so I'm not getting this idea. Tracy looks like she's still in bed. I feel like I'm still in bed. <laughs> Tracy, quick question. Where's your hat? It's in my hand. Okay. <laughs> it will be on my head at some point. Okay. <laughs> Just checking. I guess everyone else is still in bed because only our table is set up and nobody is out for game drive yet. So, early people, let's go. This is definitely needed. It should help. <laughs> Breakfast is served. Best meal of the day. Let's eat. Tracy, you excited? Doing Tracy's that, still sleeping. That my husband's gonna kill me for, but yeah. he's gonna give me energy. So. <laughs> She's eating Nutella. <laughs> <laughs> the sun is up, bellies are full. Let's go find some animals and maybe cheetahs. Don't Probably you not. Just jinxed it. <laughs> good morning. Good morning. Sir. How are you? How are you? Great. Good. Good. How was your night? Very good. Your breakfast? Yeah. Very delicious. Perfect. Great. Okay, let's go see what happened with this zebra from last night. So we saw about eight different hyenas 
who were all like eating this half zebra now compared to yesterday and about one jackal who finally was able to steal a little piece of breakfast as well but the it was so impressive to see like the power of the jaw the hyenas it was quite something So our camp is actually in the newer section of Old Pajetta. So now we're just crossing the road, going into the main conservancy of Old Pajetta. I think it's a little chilly this morning. So we just saw some more elephants and a little tiny baby. And actually, if you watched the Cheetah Project video, you would have seen that the baby, it might be the same baby. We'll have to see. Got it. Finally found a cheetah. This is a better picture. I'll send through and Dave has pictures too. We already called Ravi from the, the Cheetah Project. We're gonna send them some good photos, uh, a pin location of uh, where we spotted it, and hopefully this is gonna help. Thank you so much. Okay, welcome, everybody. See you this afternoon. See you <laughs> we are back from a very successful safari. We saw a cheetah. And we saw a bunch of hyenas eating a zebra. Yeah. And a baby elephant. I finally feel like we have something to contribute to the Cheetah Project now, even finally. though we were doing just yeah. like the media stuff. Yeah, got I a bunch like... of photos, <laughs> got the position, we documented our sighting. The information will be sent to the, the Cheetah Project. There you go, we, we did our part. We are important now. Yeah. <laughs> so now, um, it is not even 10, so Tracy wants to take a bath, I guess. she wants. To... I'm cold and I really want to warm up. They have great hot water here, so yeah. I think that's, I'm going to do that and make a cup of coffee because I have a There's coffee a coffee maker. maker. Just gonna call them for some milk. Yeah. It's still so windy. So windy. Last night, like, I <laughs> could have sworn that the roof was gonna fly off. Yeah. Like, it, it was, was crazy. loud. It was so windy, and the tent was, like, caught yeah. in the wind so bad that everything was shaking. Like, the like, bed. I would feel it Like, we were in, in a bed. tornado or something. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> hopefully, it's gonna better. It's gonna be better tonight. <laughs> so, yeah. See you guys later. So while Tracy is enjoying a bat and a cup of coffee, I'm gonna sit right there and edit a vlog because we're living this influencer life very differently apparently. So after a lot of editing for me and a bath and a nap for Tracy, she works hey, hard I too, got guys. Some stuff done. <laughs> like almost nothing. I need we're, <laughs> we're gonna go for lunch. And the weather right now is like a 10 out of 10. It's beautiful. It was so cold this morning and now it's perfect. Say it, Tracy. It's perfect. <laughs> so we're the first ones to arrive for lunch and we have a beautiful table overlooking the viewing hall. I think we snagged the best table. Another great meal at Matara Camp. Fantastic. Now lunch. it is time to move. Yes, because every time we have the opportunity to show you guys more than one accommodation, yeah. we always say yes. So we're gonna go pack up and go to a new home. So we just arrived in our new tent. It is the exact same thing, except it's like a mirror version of the other one that we had. But the big difference is the view. And if you ask me, this view is like much better. So the other one was a savanna view, which is basically like you're overlooking the conservancy, but it's very, very bushy. But this one overlooks the water hole. So you have a very similar view than uh, the one that we have from the restaurant. So check this out. Although you don't need a reason to be in a row. 
We came to our new tent and they had a massage table out and they offered us a massage. So you can actually get your massage here overlooking the fantastic water hole or you can actually get a massage in the bush as well. That would be pretty cool. Tracy's done. She's very, very relaxed. Are you? And now, now it's my turn and while I'm gonna get a massage, Tracy's just gonna enjoy the drafts yes. that are really trying to drink water, but it looks very hard. It doesn't <laughs> So I just got out of the shower after a very good massage. I'm not very good at relaxing, I have to say, like while I, I got my massage, I planned their next vlog in my head. <laughs> then I was trying not to laugh while she was massaging my feet. And then at some point, she did something during my face massage like, like this. And I was like, Simba. And I was trying to like not laugh. Anyway, Why how, how did you... Why does that not surprise I know. me at all? How did you find your massage? Was it, it was good? a very good massage. <laughs> um, some massage therapists I find too light. Like she was... Amazing. She has she had some strong hand, that's for sure. I looked over at one point. She's like, "Do you want to look at the watering hole?" She's like, "There's a giraffe oh, yeah. there." Oh <laughs> yeah. And I'm getting a massage. Turn my head, and there's a giraffe in the water hole drinking yeah. water. Yeah, that was pretty cool. So was now like we me. are walking back to the main lodge, and we're gonna meet with our guide because today we're doing a different kind of safari. So Something be I've ready. Never done. Yeah, let's do this. So we're in a safari truck. Are we going on a normal safari? Not quite. That's our stop. Tracy, what are we doing? We're going on a safari bushwalk. Something we have never done yet. Wish us luck because we saw a lot of hyenas <laughs> and even a cheetah this morning. Don't run! Okay, you try them first. <laughs> Is it pretty good? Right. It's good. Well, that was a very nice little walk. Saw some zebras and gazelle, a bunch of birds. Uh, learned a little bit about the wildlife and the conservancy here. And now we're gonna have a beautiful bonfire for sunset. We've got snacks, the perfect gin and tonic, and a fire and a sunset in the bush. It's perfect. Time to go back to the camp and have some supper. So we just came back from our walk slash safari drive slash bonfire slash sundowner. <laughs> it was great. And this is like this sundowner was phenomenal yes but even thinking with the rest of the camp i'm gonna give you a sneak peek um it has reached our top three three yeah this is like, in our top, top three, three don't, safari don't camps. ask me to like put them in order right now but it's no. definitely in our top three it's phenomenal yeah. like everything has been great here and it's just i like the bonfire tonight was like the icing on the cake for 100 percent. it was amazing the cherry on the sunday the cherry on top cherry on top cherry on top but it's Sunday. Just we're gonna go have our last supper here because I'm hungry and we're gonna catch you guys back up after that. Well, probably at the supper. What am I talking about? You guys are coming with us for supper. back from another great meal and it is not done no 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 because tomorrow we're doing one last thing so the only thing that we have never done oh, so in all another Pregetta. thing that we haven't done yeah here. so yeah. stay posted because for now we're gonna tracy lit up some candles we have a glass of wine it's all romantic it's time yeah, for us to take some time for us yeah see you guys in the morning good morning another great and beautiful day in old Pregetta. a little gray though did How you? do you not have a sweater on? Yeah, it's a little chilly too. It's okay, weird. it's not it's not that great of a day. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. Yeah. It's okay. <laughs> we sleep really well. Oh my goodness, that was so amazing. so good. Now we're yeah. gonna go have a quick breakfast, pack up our things, and this video is not done because we're gonna go do oh something else. So stay posted for that.
much better with a sweater. Oh, that's kind of cool. I should put that on a sweater. Much better with a sweater. If anything, I should put that on a sweater because I'm the one who always wears sweaters. Yeah, I rarely wear it. <laughs> so anyway, now we're going to enjoy this beautiful view yeah. and some eggs. So the video is not done yet, so do not Don't click away. away. But we're going to do a very, very quick review of this place because, well, just, just the highlight points because we already said everything. Yeah. So one highlight, Wi-Fi is good. Um, much better than the last place. Yeah, she was able to actually upload her last it, vlog overnight. But, yeah, yes. so not as good at home, but pretty close. Yeah, um, I'm sure upon request, you can ask for a coffee maker. So I woke up and made my own coffee every morning. Yeah. That's fantastic. Otherwise, the tents are amazing. Bed super comfy, like oh, yeah. very beautiful. Amazing view of the water hole 100%. if you're on this side of yeah. the tents. So ask for a, a water hole view. It's, it's like, the other one was great, but this one is like next level for yeah. sure. And shout out to our guide, Alfred. He yes. was amazing. Really, really nice. Yeah. So great game drive. We were actually super lucky this time. Yeah. Uh, first time we were actually this lucky in Opageta, so that was very nice. And food was delicious. Staff was amazing. Shower, immediate hot water, and good shower yeah. pressure. All that to say that this place made it into our top three. We we did not expect Fantastic. that. Fantastic. But it did. Yep. Um, I'm gonna end it by saying I don't have a negative thing to say about this place. No. 10 out of 10 would do it again. Absolutely. Come okay. check it out. Okay, let's go pack and let's go to the next place. You guys, you guys have to see that. I'm so excited to go there. So excited. So fun fact, this land that the camp was on has actually been acquired eight years ago. We thought it was a lot newer than that. Um, but they're still trying to do, like there's still a lot of work to be done as in bringing some of the animals over, that type of thing. So this is why we come out of the gate and we cross the road into the other side and we're in the main Olpajeta area. So we're gonna do our last activity. Can't wait! So the one thing that we have not done yet in Olpajeta, we are at... The Chimp Sanctuary. Yeah. So let's go see some <laughs> chimps. So here at the sanctuary, they actually have 34 different chimpanzees and they were all actually uh, rescued from Central and West Africa. Yeah, so like Rwundi, Rwanda and Burundi. Mainly, yeah. Those chimps were actually victim of poaching and also uh, being kept as pet in houses. And this is why they started the, uh, the, the refugee here because basically those animals are actually endangered. So the cage behind me is not a joke. It's just in case a chimpanzee escape while there's people uh, within the area, but that never happened. But it's there just in case. So the reason why we have to have our mask on and we can't get close to them is with the current situation, the chimps are 98.6% human. Like, they're the closest to humans. So there's not really data or anything because they don't want the data. <laughs> but if they could catch anything, don't want that to happen. So this is why we can't go too close to the enclosure compared to normally. So we ended up coming very close to our lunchtime. So most of them were gone for an early lunch because they know when lunchtime is. Yeah, but we managed to see Safari, Max and Oscar. Yeah. Which was pretty cool. It was cool. And at the end, Safari decided to get up and walk a little bit. And then he's like, eh, I don't want to do this. And Let's go back to sleep. Slap. Anyway. <laughs> So, pretty cool. Yeah. I suggested, like, you know, sometimes if you ask why, like, uh, park entry fees are so expensive, it's because of a project like this. So, it's important to come and encourage them. Yeah. But otherwise, that is it for us. It is time to go back to Nairobi, the, the concrete jungle, as uh, somebody was calling it at the, the other you camp. Know. I like that. So, don't forget to like this video, subscribe to the channel, and see you guys in the next one. <laughs>